Hi everyone and welcome. Today we're diving into a topic that's close to many of our hearts, the connection between medication and weight gain. It's a common concern, and rightfully so. You're diligently taking your meds as prescribed, hoping to feel better, but then the scale starts creeping up. It can be frustrating, confusing, and even discouraging. Let me assure you, you're not alone. Millions of people experience this. The good news is that knowledge is power. By understanding why certain medications can lead to weight gain and what you can do about it, you can take control of your health journey. In this essay, we'll uncover the science behind medication-related weight gain, explore some of the most common culprits, and equip you with practical tips to manage your weight effectively. Remember, it's about finding a balance between managing your health conditions and feeling your best. So, let's get started on this enlightening journey together. Your health and well-being are worth it. Before we point fingers at specific medications, let's understand why this weight gain happens in the first place. Our bodies are complex machines, and medications, while often essential, can sometimes throw a wrench in the works. They can influence everything from our metabolism, the rate at which we burn calories, to our appetite, and even how our bodies store fat. Think of it like this. Your metabolism is like a furnace, burning calories for energy. Some medications can slow down this furnace, meaning you burn fewer calories throughout the day, even if your activity level remains the same. Other medications might make you feel hungrier, leading to increased calorie intake. And in some cases, medications can affect how our bodies use and store fat, making it easier to gain weight. It's important to remember that not everyone will experience weight gain from the same medications, and the amount of weight gain can vary greatly. Factors like genetics, age, lifestyle, and diet all play a role. Now, let's shed light on some of the most common medication groups associated with weight gain. Antidepressants, particularly those in the Selective Serotonin Reuptake Inhibitor, SSRI, and Tricyclic Antidepressant, TCA, categories, are often linked to weight gain. These medications are invaluable for managing depression, anxiety, and other mood disorders, but weight gain can be a common side effect. SSRIs, such as sertraline, Zoloft, Fluoxetine, Prozac, and Escitalopram, Lexapro, are often associated with weight gain over time. TCAs, such as amitriptyline, Elevil, and imipramine, Tofranil, are also known to potentially cause weight gain. Mood stabilizers like lithium, used to manage bipolar disorder, can also lead to weight gain. While the exact mechanisms vary, these medications can influence appetite, metabolism, and even fluid retention, all contributing to potential weight changes. Let's delve a little deeper into how antidepressants, particularly SSRIs, can lead to weight gain. SSRIs work by increasing levels of serotonin in the brain. Serotonin is a neurotransmitter that plays a crucial role in regulating mood, sleep, and you guessed it, appetite. While increasing serotonin can be incredibly beneficial for mood regulation, it can also lead to increased appetite and cravings, especially for carbohydrates. When you eat more carbohydrates, your body releases more insulin, a hormone that promotes fat storage. Over time, this can lead to gradual weight gain. Additionally, some studies suggest that SSRIs might slow down metabolism in some individuals, meaning they burn fewer calories at rest. This metabolic slowdown can further contribute to weight gain. Section 5. Culprit number 2. Diabetes medications. A surprising side effect. It might seem counterintuitive, but some medications used to manage diabetes, a condition often associated with weight loss, can actually lead to weight gain. Insulin, a hormone essential for regulating blood sugar levels, is a prime example. While insulin is crucial for people with type 1 diabetes who don't produce enough insulin naturally, and for some people with type 2 diabetes who need insulin therapy, it can also promote fat storage. When you inject insulin, it helps your body cells absorb glucose from the bloodstream for energy. However, if you consume more calories than your body needs, insulin can also promote the storage of excess glucose as fat. This doesn't mean you should avoid insulin if you need it. Managing your blood sugar levels is crucial. However, it's essential to be aware of this potential side effect and work closely with your doctor to monitor your weight and adjust your treatment plan as needed. Section 6. Unraveling the Insulin Weight Gain Link Let's break down how insulin, while essential for blood sugar control, can sometimes lead to weight gain. 1. Glucose uptake. 
insulin acts like a key, unlocking cells to allow glucose from the bloodstream to enter and be used for energy. 2. Excess glucose storage. If you consume more calories than your body needs, insulin promotes the storage of excess glucose as glycogen in the liver and muscles. However, these storage capacities are limited. 3. Fat storage. Once glycogen stores are full, insulin encourages the conversion of excess glucose into fat, which is stored in adipose tissue or fat cells throughout the body. This process is essential for survival, ensuring we have energy reserves during times of fasting or food scarcity. However, in our modern environment with abundant food, this natural process can sometimes lead to unwanted weight gain, especially in the context of insulin therapy. Section 7. Culprit number 3. Blood pressure medications and weight fluctuations. Even medications designed to manage blood pressure such as beta blockers and some calcium channel blockers can sometimes tip the scales. Beta blockers, like metoprolol, also known as Lopressor, and atenolol, known as tenormin, work by blocking the effects of adrenaline, a hormone that increases heart rate and blood pressure. While effective in managing hypertension, Beta blockers can also slow down metabolism and reduce the body's ability to burn fat for energy, potentially leading to weight gain. Some calcium channel blockers, such as amlodipine, also known as Norvasc, can also cause fluid retention, which can show up as weight gain on the scale, although it's not an increase in body fat. Section 8. Beyond the medications, lifestyle choices matter. It's crucial to remember that medication isn't always the sole culprit in weight gain. Our lifestyle choices, particularly our diet and exercise habits, play a significant role. If you're taking medications known to potentially cause weight gain, it's more important than ever to adopt a healthy lifestyle. This means focusing on a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains. It also means incorporating regular physical activity into your routine. Remember, every little bit counts, even small changes like swapping sugary drinks for water, taking the stairs instead of the elevator, or going for a brisk walk during your lunch break can make a difference over time. Section 9. Taking Charge. Tips for Managing Medication-Related Weight Gain. Now that we've explored the why behind medication-related weight gain, let's empower you with actionable tips to manage your weight effectively. 1. This is crucial. Never stop taking your medications or adjust your dosage without consulting your healthcare provider. They can help you understand the potential side effects, monitor your weight, and explore alternative medications or treatment options if needed. 2. Keep a food journal to track your calorie intake and identify any potential triggers for overeating. This can help you make healthier food choices and manage portions. 3. Pay attention to your hunger and fullness cues. Eat slowly, savor your food, and avoid distractions like TV or smartphones while eating. 4. Drink plenty of water throughout the day. Sometimes our bodies confuse thirst for hunger, leading to unnecessary snacking. 5. Engage in regular physical activity. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise most days of the week. Find activities you enjoy to make it sustainable. 6. Prioritize getting 7 to 9 hours of quality sleep each night. Sleep deprivation can disrupt hormones that regulate appetite, leading to increased hunger and cravings. Section 10. Talking to your doctor, your path to a healthier you. Remember, your doctor is your partner in health. Don't hesitate to have an open and honest conversation about your concerns regarding medication-related weight gain. Here are some questions to ask your doctor. I've noticed some weight gain since starting this medication. Is this a common side effect? Are there alternative medications I could try that might be less likely to cause weight gain? Are there any lifestyle changes I can make to help manage my weight while on this medication? Can you refer me to a registered dietitian for personalized nutrition guidance? Section 11. Conclusion. Your health, your weight, your journey. In conclusion, while certain medications can sometimes present the challenge of weight gain, remember that you're not alone and there are steps you can take to manage your weight effectively. Knowledge is power. By understanding the potential link between medication and weight gain, being proactive in tracking your weight and engaging in open communication with your doctor, you can navigate this aspect of your health journey with confidence. Your health and well-being are a priority, and by taking charge of your health choices, you can strive to feel your best both physically and mentally.